Right. Checking everything's working. Right. Working things okay. Let me just check the audio. Yeah, seems fine. Okay. Good. Right. So, I'm going to just start with some deck building to begin with. Just kind of looking for what to really build. I think either a Hector build, a Hector deck, but I'm not sure. Right, welcome guys. So this is just going to be kind of chill, just deck building. We can do some matches if you guys want. And it's gonna be on YouTube afterwards, on my channel. So yeah, I just wanted to build a new deck before doing any matches. These are my current decks. Uh, so Alphonse, Sirius, very aggro deck. Joshua, you know, normal mid-range. Marth, because of course, and a Black Knight deck. And hey. Hey Mutsu, how are you doing? So yeah, do you guys have any suggestions for an MC? Just don't really know what to pick for my new deck. I was thinking either like Elliewood maybe, or Hector. Any of those two might be a good idea. Or maybe Nana, because I don't really have any yellows. So Nana might be a good one to start with that. But I'm not sure. Uh, let's see what Nana has. Add up the top two cards of your deck to your bonds face down. And when you control six or more bonds, this unit gains range 1, 2, and thumb. It's pretty good. It comes at base 7 to mage. Then add the top two cards of your deck to your bonds face down. Oh, this is the same card. Add up to two of your bonds to your hand with the same name as your main character. That's okay. And add a card from your hand to your bonds. It's good. She's pretty good at bond accelerating. What about her first one? Add one unit from your retreat to your hand except Nana. It's fine. Because I've been a leaf bond, bond card, this unit gets an attack, range one and sword. And you can probably get a critical to style. Okay. Uh, it's Beluria could be actually because I also don't have a black or white deck, so Beluria might be a good idea. Not really sure how to build her though. Uh, so just the I know this is her main promotion from playing you. When this unit destroys an enemy of bad battle, you're gonna have a cost for a lower unit, a lower white card to your hand. Yeah, because it's all about drawing, isn't she? So you want Mitama and you want um, Ared, I guess. And Selkie, because she could deploy. Yeah. You 
Come on, let's make a Valuria deck. Why not? Oh, actually... Hmm. Let's make both a Nana and a Valuria deck. Let's make a new deck. Nana. There we go. Let's first grab all the Nanas. Uh, I don't like this one. She looks kind of creepy in this one. Uh, I'll just go for the normal one. Got four. Hmm. Right. So what do we want? I think we just probably want one of these. It's not too useful. Two of these and two of these. Should be fine. Actually, maybe four of these. Because you kind of need that for mid game. Uh, that would be 11. That seems okay. Right. Feel free to just post suggestions for cards. Okay, mm -hmm. so got Nana. We need Leaf and Finn. Wrong. Uh, where's Leaf? Could put a Celif too because he works well. He works well with Leaf. Um, does he have any anything about? Lift and Finn and Finn later on. Right. Sea Leaf. When you place a card in your bonds, you just turn this unit against Tain Attack. It's okay. I'll just have it for you. Future Sage Lord. Flip two bonds and discard a leaf. Once per turn. For every four ones you control, the deploy a yellow, yellow unit from your retreat. It's pretty good. She needs just two orbs instead of one. Prince repartition. Repatri repatriation. Oh, I know this one. I used this one on my Black Knight deck. Uh, I don't think Evil is good. Uh, let's check. Whoa. <laughs> right. Thing with Evil is, I think she can't actually move. Yeah, because impending petrification. If you control four or fewer bond, f bonds, do not untap this card at the start of your turn. Like, really, mm -hmm. she's okay. You just, she's basically just like you need to bond straight away. And if you get, you take any of your of your own of your bonds, then she's kind of screwed. But she's a good buffer. Hmm. Oh, I like this one where she's turning into stone. And she seems okay actually. If your opponent controls more of the cards than you, this card in your hand has a deployment cost of one. Yeah, but that's not really uh, useful, isn't it? Because, yeah, you wouldn't want to give field control for that. Leader of the Free Blade is nice. Buffing somebody. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Okay, I'll think about her. Let's go back to Leaf. What about this one? Just turn this unit gains range 1 to untone. Mm -hmm. Homecoming, when this unit destroys an enemy by battle during mm -hmm. during the turn, you use Sword of Light and flip free of your bonds. That might actually be okay. Um, he has to flip, flip two bonds, right? So you can use it to, to flip one. Two cards of your deck. Oh wait, music stop. What? Excuse me. There we go. Right. Let's keep looking. Huh. I think I definitely want this one. Like this one sounds kind of good for like some stuff. 
Let me just give the song. So I'll find another song. Oh, this is a good one. Hang on. There we go. Put us in the mood of. Um, hi, Poi. I'm making a Nana deck. Um, that's what I'm doing. Nana MC. Kind of because mainly because I don't have a yellow deck, so I kind of want to dwell into yellow a little bit. See what it's like. Experiment a bit. Um, hmm. Let's put Finn. Where's Finn? Apprentice Knight. Will be supported by Quano, Ethlin, or Leaf this game again. Ten attack. At an, an attack element. It's pretty standard. Great for lands. Just turn to your lands unit gain 10 attack. It's not very useful. What about this one? After his unit attack, there's no destroy an, an enemy on top of this unit. Move any number of enemy backlight units except the main character. That's good for control. Right. What about this one? At the end of his turn, you can have this card gain 20 attack until the end of your opponent next turn. I mean, that's better than this one. Black yellow deck with Ophelia. <laughs> yeah, I haven't seen many decks run, run like black and yellow. Like usually when I see black decks, it just run white. Like black and white and that's it. I haven't really seen a deck, a black or white deck that runs anything. That's not Fates. So I'm just kind of curious towards those. Towards those. I wonder if I should make, make this multicolored. I probably should. Um, Let's see. I'm trying to think about Lackeys. Wait. Oh no, no, that's not good because I will really get to use her. I'll, I will put a cell if it kind of work with Leaf. Raise of Ground Veil. Noble of Light. This one gains the name of your name of your name of your name. Oh. Of your main character. Huh. That's interesting. So I could use. I could indeed use her and let me just make Leaf sell it like this sell it bond exclusive. Red version of Nana. And like, what does she usually run? Like, so it's basically dual color, yellow and red. Is that what it, what is usually run on her? Right, let me just see this. Taking in his yellow, so it's two orbs instead of one. It's pretty useful. I like the old art of leaf. I'll have that. And Savior of Light. When you place a yellow card in your bones, you can move an enemy backline unit. Pair of Miraculous Light. When you control a Sigurd, that unit and this unit gain 10 attack. Right, I'm at four of these. Okay, that's 35. I should probably dwell into red now. A lot uh, lack. <laughs> Nana press plus an Ancos. How's Alessia and Ancos? Which an Ancos? Cost seven. Send all other units to the field, bond face, to the field, on the field to bond face down, except the main characters. This unit. Gains 10 attack for each face down bonds. Yeah, I guess so. Thing is, I don't know if I'll deploy him, because, like, it's already, not really planning on running black or white. Let's see red. Um, let's see Nana's skills again. Um, Where's the Nana that I'm looking for? This one. Okay, top two cards of your deck to your bond face down. Or you control six or more bonds as you need to range one down. When this unit is placed on your bonds, you can add one of your bonds to your hand. I'm not really gonna use that one. But how do you deploy him though? 
if he's black and white like if you said because you said that you usually run like um yellow and red oh or did you just bond the nankos to get to get him is that what you do you just bond himself to deploy him right so what do the others do you can level up garon or gunter with this card well, you control four or more face down or bonds this unit gets 80 attack and oh that's pretty good black sun once per turn destroy an enemy unit except their main character if it's this is a level up unit you can use skill this gun more than once per turn okay when you level up into this unit you can deploy any number of anankos from your retreat while this unit is level up all ally alanko gain okay You may control more than one Anankos. So I could like ch class change him. Like level him up into this one. Right. Why is th isn't this on auto play? What the hell? Right. Let's try this again. Um, I'm gonna just put an autoplay on. I don't get why it's not on. Okay. There we go. Right, so all three versions of an angles. I guess I could just run um, black cases. Black cases for this seems good enough. Maybe take one, like one leaf out. It's only gonna work when I want when I bomb this leaf. This uh what is it? This seller. Third turn. Well yeah, but that might be useful. Three more face up bonds to the turn. Right one two. Uh, I think I'll do it. Do this and run maybe we don't need this many sellers. And I think that's good. It's good. I'll save it. So there's here's the deck. Main yellow. And then there's an anchors here for fun. Like a zero two, sugar three, sugar one, and an anchors. I who should I replace though? Like, should I maybe take this four fin out? Like take four fin out, leave this fin. Right, what does this fin do? Yeah, take this fin out. And then have um, maybe like Shigure. Take this fin out, maybe Take this Celef out, this three Celefs. Um, right, let's see. Let's take this, these fins out. Let's go Shigure. I do need a flyer. Right, so Shigure's for free. You will top a card your, the top card of your deck and move any number of allies with the same color as the revealed card. Destroy an enemy stone unit besides the main character, and then destroy this unit. Treasured memory, if you control another white unit and another black unit besides this, this, besides that unit, 
This unit can never be destroyed by costs and effects. Yes. I think that's good. Like, I should probably take. Um, this thing to take out. Maybe take two of these out. Like, two of manas. Not main promotion. At least two. You know, 52 cars is fine, they say. So this could be fine. Um, trying to think. Maybe I don't need this many Anankos to run, run through. But then I could run like two Azuras. Let's try that. Right. Let me just check. Okay, so I'm gonna host the game. If you you guys can join up if you want, and like we'll have a queue with the spectators with the spectators maybe. So I'll just host. There we go. I'm load my Nana deck. I'm also gonna post this in Discord. Well, there's, there's already a thing there. So. Okay. Right. So you guys can just join up if you want. I'll just wait for some matches for now and see. And if there's somebody in, you can just join up as well. And you'll be like in a queue with the spectators here. I'll check. I'll keep an eye on who joins first. I'll write it down. Keep a queue going. Right. So. Yeah, this deck feels okay. Like I like the whole leaf thing, the whole Celeph with Lac with Lacus's combo. That feels like it will work pretty well. Um, and like, if not, then Lacus is also is also like pretty solid. Like base 70, one two range usually. It's pretty good. Right. Let's see. Also, by the way, guys, the game is up if you want to join. Also, six viewers, that's nice. Hey, everyone. Hope you're all having a good day. Right. Um, I'm just trying to think how this, like, how the synergy in this deck would work. So, when it comes to Anankos. Like having multiple might be useful. Right, just a minute. Right, I'm back. Sorry about that. Just jumped someone. Gotta put my microphone back. Let's play what place where it was. Right. Let's see. What do we have? Uh, 
So like what all, what what decks have you have you guys built recently? If any slash what's your favorite deck and why? Mine it's probably um well Marth and Alphonse, those aren't my two favorites. Mainly because it just feels great using them. Maybe the reason why. Also, in the meantime, we can start on the on the black deck. Might as well make a Valoria deck and clear everything. Right. So. Let's see. Valoria. So we have this one. A card with 10 support from your retreat to your hand. Or you control it any other part. I like finding units this unit. When this unit is attacked, this turn this unit gains 10 attack. This might be useful to get the promo. I think I'll go with this one. Just that one. Uh, for release and uh, for release. Sounds good. This unit's attack is gonna be evaded, except by the main character. When the scene destroys the unit by battle, you can add one cost three or lower and below yeah. below it from your GT to your hand. Cost three or level below. Right, so I'm gonna run. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Oh yeah. Oh hello. Takes ass up. Takes a selfie. <laughs> that was really, really weird. Well. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I made this layout. Right. I'm currently making a Valoria deck, I just made a Nana deck. Yeah, there's also a game open for anybody to join. Which, if anybody does, I'll just um, save the deck and play and keep going later. But yeah, welcome to the stream. Enjoy your time. Right. So, Mutsu, what did you. What else did you run with Valoria? I know you ran a red with her, where it seems pretty useful. Don't guard your hand and draw it if it's not. Yeah. One year for a retreat your hand except a ret. That might be useful. One, two, three, four. Uh, you write me Tama. Let's see. Yeah. I know that you run eight me Tamas. So it's the same. Oh, this is different. This is a bow one. Shuffle your opponent's retains into your deck. Into the deck. Ooh, that's pretty good. Well, if I got a flying unit, this unit gains 10 attack. Control land a card. Okay. Alright, Azura Sulky Kana. Uh, and Percy. Uh, I'll put a Selkie there because she's definitely very useful. One, two, three, four. What about the cost ones? What about this one? When a unit is deployed, turn this unit against an attack. At the start of your turn, send the top card of your deck to the retreat. You can flip one bond and destroy a card. Turn the music down a bit. Wait, where, where was I? Right. You can flip one board and deploy that card. You can I level up, lose this effect, and destroy at the end of the turn. 
Oh, it costs one. There are five or more units on the field, this unit can attack. Mm -hmm. This turn, this front leg unit can attack any units regardless of range. An attack camera might be useful. Yeah, this one doesn't seem like the buff seems like it'll never happen. Yeah, the archer seems kind of nutty, really. I think I might have her instead, because I actually kind of like that effect. Prevent them from getting avoids. So I'm gonna get rid of the other one. Where is she? There she is. Right. Let's see. I'm thinking about making making it uh, a triple color deck. Maybe adding some purple in there. Um, have like Azura, and then add up, and then use purple to add like Hollywood, Nino, things like that. You know, Nino just for more cards, just get a get a boys. I don't know. Thinking maybe I could do that. Add Canas maybe to like choose what to have on top of the deck. I could like put an Aret there, put an Anino, have an unlike Mayhem draw, an Aret, or just put whatever on top and get make a red get it. I might do that. I think I might run purple with this. So I might, I think I'll run Nino. I'll run Nino, just, you know, to get for protect and choosing my supports as well. That's pretty useful. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I'll run to Azurus. To Elise. And... I'm trying to think. I'm thinking Kanas. By the cost for Kanas. And I could take out one of these Ninos and put this Kanas. And maybe. Hmm. Maybe take two of these out. Two of these Sulkies. And have. Uh, Nelly Wood, just for more field control. And buffing. Seems okay. Kind of just experimenting, so if this doesn't work at all, then you know that this didn't work. Instead of dilting with purple, you may also want to earn Azura 2, which allows you to look at the two cards before you use the red. Yeah, I th I'm running Azura and Kanas because I think that might be a good thing. Oh, oh, Poi's here. Oh, hi, Poi. Right. I'll just save the deck and we can play. Oh, here's my Nana deck. Right. Let's try out this deck. Where's the cost one? Here she is. No. Hello. Hey, Poi. How are you doing? Hello. Right, let's see. I can find the close one. Where are you? Ah, oh, there it is. And I'll keep that. It's pretty good. Let's roll. Roll the five. Yeah, no, no, because I kind of experimented, experimenting, so these decks might not be that amazing. Right, I'll start. 
Before you roll the one. Mulligan. Okay. By the way, is the stream okay? Audio good? Everything good? I did tell that should be fun. Right, good luck, have fun. Okay, let me just see. Unit's cards to your bond, and you have three of your cards in your hand, draw a card. Hmm. I think I'll just punch Shigure in. And call it a day. <laughs> That's good. Glad you're enjoying the music. Played a Nana before either, so this should, this should also be interesting. Mm -hmm. Thought it might be a um, good MC to try out yellow as well. Oh, it's my turn. Right, draw. Just play this guy here. Bring you up. And. Okay. Pack a bit. It's a hit. I'm up. Attack with Nana. Oof. Right. Turn. <laughs> All right, I should probably like hang on, I'm gonna do something. I'm gonna just put. Hang on. Lot. Blue Black Knight. Add a card from your hand to the bondsman's face down. Okay. It's 20, 60, that's a hit. So she doesn't have anything on her Nope. Goodbye. Think who to bond again. Think. I might just bond you. Wait, do I want to do that? 
yeah. I think I will. And I'll use lead spawn kill, bone skill. I'm just replying to someone. Spawn skill, put Celep in the bonds and bring him to my hand. There we go. And now I'll use. Oh, wait, that was kind of stupid. Never mind. I'll probably just say that. Sorry about that. Um, right. I don't really have anything to deploy. <laughs> So I think I'm just going to have to hit a hit, really, because I only have a cost 4 promotion so I need to wait one more turn, can't do much about that. Top 2 cards of your deck to your bonds face down, it's going to make it 6, so she will get range 1, 2 on tone, you can add one of your bonds to your hand, then I can deploy an anchor straight away which is pretty neat. So. Control for a more face down bond, this unit gets 80 attack and range 1 to rule, that's pretty good. Right. Okay, I'll draw. Gonna have to bond her. Well, it's already done. Draw. And I'll use hers. I don't really need it yet. Although it might be good to deploy an ankles. I think I'll do it. I use lion skin. It's two, right? Flip two bonds. Flip and flip. Talk to cross your deck to your bonds face down. Now flip them both. There we go. Right. So now I'll attack. And that's Hero Emblem. Oh yeah, I did, didn't I? Oh wait, how come? That's a hit, isn't it? Because it's a... Is it a 90 versus 90? Oh, leafing bonds. Right. Oh yeah, you're right. Barely missed. Okay. Just retreat then. Right, let's just keep going. I quite like yellow, they have kind of weird skills. I mean, they're a lot focused on bonds, just neat. Right, so, a bond, first of all. Who do I bond though? I think I bond Shigure. So then I can deploy an Ankos. Let's see. What can I do? First, 
Yeah, top two cards of your deck, two bonds, and it's down. I need to flip, flip two bonds. Then I can um, flip a bond with him. With Selif. I think I'll chill for now though. I feel like I'll wait a bit to do that. Right, I'll attack. Four right. Yeah, four or more face down bonds. So I'll support. Wait, Emlyn doesn't proc. And that's, yeah. Okay. Now we'll attack with Nana. I'll hide again. That's not a hit. Don't have anything right. Nope. And that should be it. Oh, hey, don't fear. That's a class change. Yep. Pick whoever. Right. But it's also cool because I can get to see how she works with red. She gains 10 attack, right? This is just in my turn. Okay, no. Oh, it's a self. Never mind. I should probably do that. Right. I think I'll chill for now with the bonds. Could deploy you, what do you do? During your turn when you control three or more yellow bonds, all your units gain 10 attack. Discard a Selef, turn all your bonds to your hand. Hmm, so you don't do much. Last tap. Okay. I think I'll keep you. Just attack Sophia with Nana. Oof. It's not great. So she's base sixty, right? Oh wait, no, I have less, so she's base 70. Oh, during your turn, so she's base 60. That's good. That worked then. Let's do it. Yeah, yeah. Right. And let's just attack with an ankles again. Port. And that's my turn. Let's have this.
So what what decks have you got have you guys made recently? And for his promotion cost, this unit gains 10 attack. Okay, it's pretty scary. <laughs> That's cool. So you're planning to make the deck IRL. It's pretty cool. Right. Hmm. Should I bond you or not? Third, and then flip to flip this, flip these two, add two more bonds, and then unflip one with sell it. I think that's what I'll do. Right, so use lion skin. I'll flip you, and I'll flip you. Then I'll use Celeph's bond skill. So I'll return him to hand and put him. Guy in. And I'll use his spawn skill to unflip. And I think I'll unflip this guy in case I get a lack. Tap. My mouse is not working properly. Right. Support. She's 80, right? She gains 10 attack until the end of the old one extends turn. Go. And another self. Right. my bond area a bit more neat and tidy. Or Let's 
draw. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. I'll deploy you. She has three more face up on Sejin against Tomb Range 1, 2. I'll do this. Up. And she has base 80 because of this Celif skill, for because of Noble, Noble of Light, uh, support. Okay. Um. Alright, let's attack with an Ankos. And that's a self. Oh, that was lucky. And I'll attack with Nana. Okay. Nice evade. And that's my turn. Right, you guys enjoying the music by the way? You should check these uh the it's from the people in, in the title. They have really nice songs in their channels if you gonna if you guys wanna check it. Also, um, Mutsu, what cards are you looking for? Are you like gonna buy just... Um, how do you call them? Just packs? Or are you gonna buy individual cards? I was thinking I might do that. Um, I'm going to the UK in January, so I th I'm thinking I might get some cards then, because they're not imported here. Sadly. Right, it's base eighty again. Oh, there's also him. Okay. Let's see what he does. Final Holy War. Discard a Celef once per turn, return any number of your bones to your hand. It's pretty cool. Oh wow. That is a lot of cards. Woo. Right. Retreat. 
can I deploy? I can deploy Finn and I can deploy a Celeph. I think. I do have a Celeph. Right. So I think I'll put you here. Get some tap. Flip two bonds. And discard a leaf. Top of retreat. And I have one, two, three, four, one, two, three. I can deploy one. So I'm gonna deploy you. That's leaf skill. Deploy your unit from a retreat. So with this, I'm gonna do I should probably move her up. It's not great. Attack her with an Ancos. Should have deployed Finn, shouldn't I? Probably should have deployed Finn because I could have just moved moved her, I think. Alright, that's it. Finn. Let's check Finn. Where are you, Finn? Flip and bone with any numbers of enemy backline units except the main character, so it wouldn't have mattered. Okay. Also, did I draw at the beginning of the turn? Can't remember. Uh, let's put something else. Right, let's check if I draw. If I did draw. I did. Okay, okay, never mind. Um, she stopped. Um, he stopped. Actually, six bonds is you know, destroys two or so of one. I'm gonna keep going at you. Oof. It's not good. Okay, barely hits. Top of retreat. Attack you. Okay. And attack sell it with sell it. Right, and that's for smart, and that's my turn. Bought in the video cards for my deck. I might buy some display when they show will sell them. So do you live in Japan? What's it? Or do you have a shop that just imports cipher cards? I'm quite enjoying this deck, it works quite well. Light, that's the heal, right? Uh, Light of the Fairy Queen, when this card is played from your hand, the promotion cost question, you have 4 free wards, add a card from the retreat to your orbs. What happened? Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, you have enough. What's wrong? Oh no, retreat. <laughs> Rip. Right. Man, that's kind of. Yeah, that sucks. A shop in France. Five French communities really good at import and they're persuaded shop to buy some. Oh, that's really cool. Huh. It's pretty cool. <laughs> um, people here don't really know what Fire Emblem even is, so it's kind of tricky. It's a hit. Right.
right? I'll draw. Let's draw. Ah, that's pretty good. I just don't have anything to actually use it. Shouldn't have bonded that much. Right, on top. Scratch mm -hmm. Elif. Anything? Train enemy unit. Just scratch a face down bond. Strain enemy unit except the main character. Right, I'll use uh, Black Sun. Scarred a face down bond to the top of retreat. And I'll destroy Jenny. So I'll attack you. Good game. Ah, good game, boy. This was my hand. Good game. Good game. That was a fun game. That's really cool, Mutsu. That's really, really cool. Um. Oh, that's a nice hand. <laughs> good game, man. This deck is fun. It's quite a fun deck. Quite happy what I built it. How I built it. Might change my mind a bit and try uh, hair with red cards, but so far it's cool. Well, I think that. Well, yeah, you could have won. That good really game. hurt you. But yeah, good game. And by the way, um, Paul, you want to do another one to try my Valoria deck? Or are you cool? I don't mind either. If you leave, then I'll probably end the stream here as well, guys. Um, if not, then I could try the Valoria deck that I just made. All right, see you. See you later. Well, actually, I wait. If does, does any of you guys want to join? I would like to try my the Valoria deck that I made. Just trying to see if it's okay. Oh, who else was? Let's see. Um, okay, there's a guy in Discord that wants to play, so might as well I'll just uh, do a new game. Oh, do I? Do I have a password? Uh, I'll reopen the room. Hang on, disconnect, go back. Oh, why did I disconnect? I could just close the room. Never mind. Put some more music. Oh, come on, Lucky. That was a dumb decision. Right, I might just reopen Lucky. I can just join this. Right, save. <laughs> now it should work. There we go. Oh, he made again. Okay, I'll join. It's not letting me join. I'll host. Oh wait, I didn't check if I had a password. Uh, close game. Let's host password. Let's have a password. Okay, I'll load my Valoria deck. Hmm. 
There we go. I'm just gonna tell this guy I'm streaming. Okay. <laughs> there we go. Uh, right, let me get my MC. I'm gonna type the things out in this hello. Just... Yeah, he just said hello Twitch. Uh, where is Valoria? Okay. Can I refine the MC quickly? Where is Valoria? Right. Mulligan. Oh, he thirsty is. Let's do this. Done. Shuffle. I'll draw. I'll mull. Mulligan. Deck. Shuffle. Draw six. That's better. One, two, three, four, five. Roll. Roll the three. He rolled a six. Right, so he probably starts. Wait, for real? He said he used a unit tactic that's not legal anymore. Wait. Right. Oh, what's happened? Watch that, Lucky. Lucky messing up. Yeah, it's also kind of my fault because of forgetting to like change that. Um, Sorry. I'll take her. Right, draw. Bond this Nina. Who to deploy? In the retreat. Don't really have anybody. Not you. Look at the top cards of the deck. The discard one and place the other back in your deck. 
Uh, probably not worth it to deploy her right now. I'll just play this Nino. And tap. Just attack again. Get some attacks in. Attack. Fate emblem. Uh, that's not a hit though. Uh, so let's retreat. Attack with Valoria. Oh, hi, Titania. Or oh, Titania. However, you guys want to call her. Also, my phone is not showing me the chat. <laughs> Let me just reconnect. There we go. Chat's back. Retreat. Uh, okay. Oh, yeah, he used this thing. Okay, right. Let's see. Chat, if I missed anything. Nope. Also, what what MCs did you guys suggest? Um, here's my list of MCs. It's just support. It's itself. It's orb. It's draw. There's no point having you, is there? Turn you're going to two or more other black units. All fine allies gain 10 attack. This unit destroys an enemy by a battle. You can add a ghost for a white card to your hand. It's pretty useful. Hi, mm -hmm. Oh, this is strange. I don't really see an Astra run risen. Should be interesting. Right, so flip a bond. I'll use hairball. And I can add a cost 4, right? Or lower white card to your hand. I could just ask at this Mitama. Hmm. Who do I want though? Do I want this Selkie? Like you need from your hand. I think I want this Selkie. Top of hand. And I'll attack with this Nino. Just to see if I get anything. <laughs> I know, right? I, do, I don't really see how that'll work, but it'll be interesting to see for sure. Um, put this on. A bit loud. Just a minute. Right back. So, stream's fine. It's frame rate fine and everything fine. Anna or Ogma and see, boy, I see you. And why those two? Like, what do they have? Have really? I saw Ogma. I don't like. I don't know. I just not sure. Quite. I'm not quite sure what he can do. Like, he seems okay, but like, just okay. <laughs> right. Uh. Okay. Support, 
So it's Ash Nurse base 60, plus 20, is that a hit? I don't think it is, right? Okay, let's draw. Oh, hi, Mintama. Da -da 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 -da. Who should I, what should I do? I'm tempted to use Mintama, but at the same time his retreat is not that amazing right now. I want to wait for him to get a few more Ashnards before I put it back in. Back in. Huh. I think I might play Selkie this turn. I might um, on this Mintama, play the Selkie, and then I could also deploy. It has to be black, right? Because for a lower, I could deploy a red. That sounds like a good plan. And tap. Reveal one. Or reveal and put one card from your hand on top of your deck. Once per turn, I want card to as the name. No, this one. During your turn, while you control two or more other black units. So not now. Okay. So does he have anything? So he can evade. Cannot evade as you control Ashnard. I'm gonna get rid of him. Or try at least. And that's a self. It's kind of oof. Mm -hmm. So to the top of retreat. I'm gonna use everybody dance. Flip a bond. Gonna flip you. And deploy you. Back there. I'm gonna use memories. Tap this unit, reveal the top card of your deck. If it's not a white card, it's got a card. And draw it. So, top of hand, it's pretty good. Uh, uh, uh. I'm gonna do this, support. Let's attack emblem, right. And I'll attack with Nino because why not? And that's an orb, yay. So, Ogma gives himself a buff every time you deploy a cost to a low. Oh, that's good. Is he like, um, so he's basically aggro, is he? Hannah grabs a baits when she baits. Oh, this one's broken. Right. Didn't get Kanas yet. Quite like Kanas. He get, like, I like him because he, he just gives you free draws and you can pick whatever mage you want. It's pretty neat. Which is why I'm thinking I might actually use the other Mitama because then I can draw her with Kanas. I do like the idea of reflush, re reflush, <laughs> reshuffling the retreat into the deck. That sounds pretty good. Oh, hi, Risen. That's okay because I have an early weed. Oh, hello. That's a lot of units. Um, support. That's a self. Do I want to defend or not really? 20 attack. What was the thing? What was the thing? What was his support? Oh, was there? Let me just send this to the retreat. Support. Uh, what is your support? Our reason. That sucks. Uh, Rajayan effect. If you do move this unit to the same area. Fair enough. Let's put some more music. And grab the Hannah from those cards. Ah, with the right setup, you can have a ton of A's in hand. 
yeah, that is a lot of resin. Right, I'm gonna put a song. Support. Oh, hi, Gray. It's in against an attack. You develop. Okay. Can see. Retreat. And this is actually fine because I have a Ellie weed. Bond you. Play this boy. And Prince of Mashner. Unless he can't be moved or something. I think he didn't hit his promo. Oh yeah. Good game. Good game. This was my hand. Good game. Yeah, that sucks. Being promised, he said I had been promised group. He he did he had a good strat though. Right. I'll do one more. I'll do I'll use my serious deck and then and I'll call I'll call it a day. Corner. Just gonna go with this boy. Done. Shuffle. Draw. I'll mulligan. Mulligan. Top of the deck. Well, that's kind of oof, but it's okay. Let's roll. Mulligan. Number two. You rolled a one. I've got my orbs, and I'll start. <laughs> oh, hi, Mark. Yeah, Elliewood MVP. Yeah, I don't, I don't really get what the point of Hammer Risen is. Um, yeah, I just... When I saw Risen, I thought that he was going to do that, so I was glad I had any wood. Um, so I start right. He has orbs? Yes. Who should I bond? I pro can probably just bond you, since I'm not going to use you early on. Didn't get my promo though. It's a bit worrying, worrisome, but uh. yeah, Hollywood is great. Right, support, and that's a hit. Hi, Marth. What do you do? Tap this ground and flip on bond. Plus ten attack. Kill the enemy opponent. Draw. Hmm. Can deploy him. Put up Mark. Mark in. Actually, I could just deploy Mark and kill her because she might be a problem. Which is what I think I'll do. Right. Pull Alencia. And I'll attack. Actually, I'll attack her with Sirius. That's a hit. Put some on Song. Right. Top of retreat. Attack with Marth. Hey, that's a hit. I think that was the right choice. Don't really want her growing him early.
I really played Persona, but I quite like this song. It's pretty, it's pretty nice. Especially this remix by this guy. It's the Insane in the Rain music. He has really good remixes of songs. He does just arrangements. It's pretty nice. It's nice. Destroy this unit. One other live unit gains 10 attack until the end of your opponent's next turn. Hey, that's good. That's not hit. So we for that. Okay. <laughs> now it is. Oh. What should I do? Should probably bond one of these two. Control two, two or more you. Other units with 10 support, this unit gains 20 attack. I could actually put Roy in, deploy Shannon, and deploy Marissa, and do Liberator. So that's plus 20. So. And that's also silence, silent strikers. Oh, hi, promo. Um, Seventy. He has uh, sixty. So Thirty. Ah, that's not hit. Man. That's a shame. Right, base 60 versus base 60. What was my thing? Oh, just that. Okay. Phew. At least I got a hit in. And let's attack with him. And let's attack emblem. So that's 70. And that's self. Great. I like this deck because like it doesn't really matter sometimes not getting the promo because you just ru you just rush everybody, so it's okay. Right, so class changed. This unit destroys an enemy battle. You can go this unit with an act from your deck. Uh, still a kill though. I'll just bond this Shannon, deploy this Beowulf. Hmm, should I save? Nah, I have two. So let's not. I won't do the thing now though. Support. Let's attack emblem. Oh, shoot. Uh, wait. Wait. And this is the support. And that's the support. Yeah, I know, but I guess well. He said it still hit. I forgot to deliver the Liberator, so I told him. But I said it still hits, but so I might as well just retreat to cards. Um, Alright, Beowulf. Support. Attack Emblem. So yay for that. I'll actually do a dead. Flip, flip, and flip. 
and yay, support. That's a hit, barely. Uh, do you have anything? Okay, that's okay. Treat and go with him just in case. Ooh, that's just enough. Well, that's, that's GG. Good game. Well, I think that's it for the Good stream. Good game. Good game. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna leave now. Okay. Thanks for the games. There we go. And I'm gonna just close the room. But yeah, thank you guys for joining in. I hope you, I hope you like the stream. Yeah, yeah, that, that felt nice. That's what I like about Sirius. Sometimes you don't really need a promo because you just win anyways. Um, I, I mean, I like that about aggro decks in general. You can just win straight away. I think that like I did well by destroying his uh, Elencia because that was going to be a bit of a problem. So I'm, gl I'm glad I did that. But yeah. Thank you, Poi. Thank you, Mutsu. Thank you, take a, takes a selfie. Thank you, every anybody who didn't talk. Thank you for joining joining in. Um, this will also be on YouTube if you guys want to rewatch it. Um, my YouTube channel is Gambling Prince, just like my Twitch name. But yeah, thank you guys for tuning in. I'll definitely do more Cipher streams. Um, hopefully, maybe we can. I can play with some guys from the CypherVit server. But yeah, hope you guys have a great day and see you guys later.